Hello everyone, Luke from Smith here, and this is going to be another story time um, clickbaity, but not really because it is true, but nothing bad actually came out of it. Um, this was about, oh, this was ages, this must have been well over 10 years ago, a little bit over 10 years ago. Um, I think this is what this was when I was um, 18, I'm now 30, so 12 years ago, something like that. God, I can't believe I still remember this. Um, yeah, it was a, the only problem is I can't remember the gear, even though if I do simple math, I'll find out. But yeah, I was about 18. 18. Let me just cut that over there because I'm not quite sure how loud, how loud um, that was on the actual camera. Yeah, I think I was about 18, 19, something like that. And it was the time of the year where um, people go for their like health kickups, that that kind of thing. Um, I don't know if it was at the um, end of the year because I know. Um, now, now we're in October. It's flu season. Everyone needs to get their flu shots. Um, or if it was like, if it was that, or a um, a health checkup, uh, which to be honest with you, I believe it to be a health health checkup. Um, I'm pretty sure you'll you'll know um, how they go, but I'm just gonna give you a quick rundown on how, on how it how it goes or how it went for me normally what 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 you do is you, you you go in and they basically check your um blood pressure putting a tight strap around your arm to to do no they do it up here not down there um to collect your blood um pressure uh sometimes um rarely though but it really depends if it's been like a couple of years they do it uh they take they do a blood test uh which um, everyone knows what blood test is nowadays um they just take a sample for analysis and um of course uh when that happens you have to wait i think it's about a week and a half a week up to two weeks that's, that's what happens with me anyway um and they basically weigh you which is like normal procedure they basically say is there any problems here, health problems, that, that, and that, and the, the usual uh, stuff for a um, normal average health checkup? Anyway, so I did all that and I waited about, uh, like I said, I think it's either, either like a week or two weeks, I'm not quite sure. I kind of forgot how it, how it went last time, even though it was earlier in the year, uh, which I had my uh, latest health checkup, checkup because. They seem to want to do it like once a year for me. I don't know why. I believe it's like once every couple of years, but like I said, I'm not really a health professional, so I wouldn't know. Um, yeah, uh, like I said, I was 18 when this happened. I went to get my um, results, and basically everything was in the clear. Um, it, usually everything is in the in the clear for me because I'm normally healthy. Uh, the blood pressure was all white. The um, everything was all white. Uh, not not normally. What's the um, problem with me is the weight. Yeah, I am a little bit. I mean, I'm not morbidly obese. Um, could have shed a few pounds. And I think last uh, last time, not in um, when I was 18, I must have been a little bit bigger. Uh, because they said that I needed to change my uh, lifestyle and uh, basically lose a little bit of weight, not not too much though, uh, because I wasn't that big uh, back then. But they said if I didn't lose any weight, I'll probably be, be dead by 20. And that was about, yeah, I'm 30 now, so that didn't happen. Um, but. They, they basically said, as long as you change your, your lifestyle and your um, he healthy uh, diet you need, you'll be fine. And to be honest with you, I don't remember changing that much about my um, um, 
diet diet or anything like I can eat, eat normally and I have cut down on certain things uh, from there um, yeah I normally like um, spurs and stuff and I because I ran back that time I used to go out like almost a couple of times a month to get like fast food and stuff yeah I cut I cut down really well on that because I'm not eating like as much junk food like McDonald's or Burger King even though I t I try my hardest to stay away from Burger King mostly because it's shite um, McDonald's is a, a lot better and KFC obviously uh, but yeah I, d I, get, I don't have much, much of that now only if it's like special stuff like the um, any new burgers that I want to try that, that sort of thing uh, any like unique stuff uh, then I'd um, give, give it a go but yeah I don't really normally do uh, much fast food or restaurant eats uh, nowadays like now and again um, just to treat myself every, every now and again but not not as much as I used to so yeah obviously I didn't die because I'm still here unless I'm a zombie or a vampire but I'm not quite sure um, so yeah uh, that was basically story time and that's a little bit short but I haven't made a story time video in a long time or in about a, f a few months uh, rather um, I do have um, two story time videos um, both have a little bit dark themes um, like really adult themes not like dirty adult like more uh, I've got no uh, software crashing it come back thank goodness for that um, yeah uh, some as I like, uh, darker themes than others and my story time uh, videos I do truthful ones I don't like make it up as I go along I like try to stick to the um, facts as long as I can remember them like I can't really do a story time vlog if I don't remember what, what actually happened so yeah luckily I did remember what happened this time around so there you go um anyway I think that's it but yeah that's it um yeah, uh, nothing bad happened, and I'm still doing great. Uh, next story time video will be I don't know. I might do a horror related uh, video or a few horror related videos this month because it's October, and I will see you uh, next time in another video.